Before you got on Saturday Night Live, uh, we were talking, you did stand up. We were talking backstage how I used to go on the street and try to sell tickets to come to your shows. Dude, yeah, I did that for a long, I did that for like three years. You I sold to. tickets on the street. And um, it's a hard job because uh, I, I sold tickets next to drug dealers. And um, no matter what I'm selling, they have a better product. Like, <laughs> I, I'd be like, comedy show, comedy show. And the guy next to me is like, and I have cocaine. So. <laughs> What do you want to do? You want to go to the show or you want to be the show? Which yeah. One? <laughs> yeah. Struggle. Before you got on Saturday Live, we were actually trying to book you for our show. I know. To do stand up, but it just happened too fast. I know. And I was so excited to do it. It's obviously a dream of mine to do stand up on this show. And I got SNL, which is a great consolation prize. Lauren, I'm very grateful. Um, but well, no, we, I'm just, yeah. We actually have a little time left. Would you want to make your Tonight Show yeah. debut? Your stand, -up, your stand up debut. You for real? Right now. Okay, what do go, I back do? go back stage. Go back. Okay. I'll introduce you. Okay. All right, go back. All right, get ready back there. Uh, here we go. Making his Tonight Show debut, please welcome the very funny Marcelo Hernandez. <laughs> Hi. Yes, thank you so much. Thank you for this opportunity. Um, <laughs> Uh, my name is Marcelo Hernandez. Um, my parents are both immigrants, and uh, they both speak English, but different levels of English. Uh, I brought my dad to SNL recently, and all the writers were like, it's so nice to meet you, it's very nice to meet you. And my dad's response was, me too. <laughs> um, my mom is much better at English. She's kind of a philosopher. She has the most interesting questions. Um, one day at dinner, she asked me, she looks at me and she goes, Marcelo, what's the difference between a butt dial and a booty call? <laughs> I was like, wow. That is an amazing question. Touche, my queen, I don't know. Um, but the funny thing to me about being Latino is that whenever I meet like really American people, they always have to tell me something. And that's how many years of Spanish they took. <laughs> and they don't even want to. It's like a tick that they have, you know? They're like, you're Hispanic? And I'm like, yeah. And then they go, oh, that's nice. I took seven years of Spanish. <laughs> and I'm like, wow, thank you so much, thank you. And they're like, oh, you don't believe me? <laughs> Lunas. Martes, sabado, suavemente. And they do that. And they only do that to us, okay? That's what's funny to me. They only do it to Latinos. They would never do it to anybody else. A white person would never go up to a black guy and be like, hey man, it was all a dream. Like they would never <laughs> do that but they do it to us, okay? And we never do it to them. That's what's funny to me, we never do it to them. My dad doesn't really speak English, but he would never go up to a white guy and be like, hey, my friend, look at me. <laughs> look at me, papi, are you ready? Look at me, ready? Monday, huh, do you like that? Monday, huh, Tuesday, do you like that? Do you think I'm stupid? Wednesday, do you like that? I know what you like, papi, I know what you like. Sweet Caroline. Ariana Grande. We'll be right back with more tonight's show. Not bad. Hey, hey.